Again, I'm recording pretty late, so I'm gonna speak low. That's why I got the speakers on. And uh, today I'm gonna talk about my day uh, meeting my manager. You know, so I got a manager and an editor. Buzz, buzz, what's up? You know, buzz, buzz, my editor, and uh, A Score is my manager. Um, and uh, we had a whole day together. I was, I thought I was gonna go up to the city, see this person, but you know, the other way happened, which it's easier for me, which, you know, when I go to the city every month, you know, it's a pain in the ass, you know, you, the other person who I'm seeing should be coming to me once in a while, you know, but whatever, I go to the city once or twice a month anyway, but, uh, yeah, like, I got a surprise, I mean, obviously I got a surprise, this shirt came from her, I do it for the subscribers, so all you new people, all you regular people that don't subscribe, I do it for the subscribers. Don't you forget that. I'll probably wear this shirt every time I sit and do do a video. You know what I mean? But she also gave me this plaque too. It says, what you think you become, what you feel you attract, what you imagine you create. It's a statement by Buddha and it's it's actually right. It's, it's so, so true. So I got that, I got this, and I got a card too, you know, look written stuff on it, and I got that over there, um, you know, I made sure I wrote the, you know, the half, I did a half a letter, a half a page, I mean, letter, uh, to the person before I met them, and then, uh, when I met them, and they did all this, I was like, no, I gotta write you a better one, because I was surprised, like, I knew, when the person was coming off the train, so you know, I took off my headphones, you know, I was listening to music, put it in my school bag, and this this black lady's like standing in front of me, and I'm like, maybe she's feeling me, you know what I mean? Like, I'm waiting for, I don't see really anybody else, I'm waiting for A school. And all of a sudden, like, <laughs> we, I figured it out, you know what I mean? Like, a score? She's like, that was the surprise. I'm like, oh shit, that's the best surprise. You know, I gave her a hug. And, um, because I thought it was a gay man for a second. You know what I mean? Like, this guy was like, well, it's not a guy, but at the time, this guy was like, first it was she, but I'm saying he, because at, at the time I think it's a he. He wasn't giving me the number to talk like text text is really easy it's always email always email always email and i was just like all right that's what he wants to do that's just what he wants to do you know and uh because he always had those i trusted him you know what i mean i grew trust i grew trust and uh and then uh you know he was like you want to hang out and i'm like yeah fuck it like i'm going to the city such and such day I didn't even go to the city yesterday, which I was supposed to. I don't, I don't know if I'm going later in the week or next week. Whatever, that's something else. But, uh, yeah, when I do, I'm going to make sure I see her, too. But, uh, you know, he was like, want to hang out? And I'm like, yeah, I, you know what I mean? I figured I was going to the city anyway. So I was like, when I go to the city, definitely. But then he was like, nah, nah, I'm going to come down there on the 28th, all right? Or something like that. And I'm like, uh... 29th, 20th, whatever day, and I, I'm like, yeah, fine, because I'm like, I'm figuring, you know, as long as you don't violate, we ain't in prison, you know what I mean, like, and he ain't no flamboyant guy, he's just like a regular dude, I guess I'm gonna eat, show him down, down port, and then, you know what I mean, that's it, at least I get out of the house a little bit, and maybe, you know, some girls, you know what I mean, some gay men know a lot of girls, you know, that are hetero, you know, that like men, like me. So, uh, I gave it a shot, you know, and, uh, it fucking surprised, that was the biggest surprise, this, this, and the letter was just awesome, but the surprise was her, 
be. My manager being a girl, not a gay guy, was that such a relief and such a weight taken off my shoulders, you know, it was just amazing. And, uh, you know, it was just awesome. I had a good time. We met uh, one something, I believe, until like around 8 o'clock we hung out. We were talking, hanging out the whole time. There was no breaks, no quietness, you know, hanging out. Brought it down, we were already in Port Jeff, so I brought it down Port, showed it like the, the ferry area. We were just looking for something to eat too, like for a while. And we wanted to make sure it was semi affordable. We didn't want to go to no high class thing where if only two people would be like 190 bucks, you know, that's just, come on. So uh, we went to, I got the cards down. <laughs> we'll probably go here again. The Gourmet Burger Bistro on uh, 5 Mill Creek Road, you know. No, I'm not getting paid by them to say this, you know, so I really shouldn't have said the address, but yeah, they on 5 Mill Creek Road, Downport, and uh, they were excellent. I got the, uh, well, first we, we got some a side, you know, the, the before meal dish. We got the uh, chicken wings with like ranch, and uh, I got like some, uh, some burger with like bacon, with a uh, jalapeno, you know, jalapeno type of burger, but I made them throw bacon, you know, some, some cheese, you know, it was awesome. It was an excellent, excellent burger, excellent. You know, it comes with onion rings too and shit. You know, we're inside sitting down eating. You know, uh, they had drinks. I don't remember the names of them. I, they, she might know, remember the name, but I got my, myself too. Uh, one at first, one at first. And uh, she got... I forgot what she got, lemonade, or I forgot what she got to drink. And, uh, you know, we're hanging out. And I was a little pissed about the drink I got because it just tasted like fucking, you know, like, like you forgot one thing, the thing that I ordered the drink for. You know what I'm saying? Like, it tasted too good, you know, too easy to drink. You know, like, just really tasted good. That's it. So, whatever. I was like, whatever. I was a pie nine to ten dollar drink. <laughs> Who cares? And uh, we ate, but then we wanted to do some stuff because she had a uh, means to uh, go online. And I brought my Oculus VR device with me, so we were like, you know, fuck it, you know what I mean? Like, we'll sit and hang out here. You know, we paid for, we paid for the meal. We like gave the girl a good tip. You know, um, it was only like. 80 something bucks or 90 bucks, something like that. It wasn't, it wasn't bad. It was 79, 70 something. It wasn't bad. Sure it was, it wasn't bad. Especially, you know, we're splitting it. Oh yeah, and we got a dessert. We split the dessert. Like a, a, a volcano something. And she knows about it. She gets it off and it was fucking great. With a side of vanilla ice cream that she didn't want. So I put it in, a, made them put it in a cup so I can eat it. And, uh, you know, after we paid, we told the lady, oh, they were, cause they were dead. Like, yo, is it up? We just hang out here for a little bit? Like, you know, like, it was raining before, and, you know, it probably could have rained any second again. She's like, yeah, no problem. Definitely no problem. So, uh, let us try the, the Oculus device. You know, first we did the laptop, and uh, I showed her that I had her as a uh, manager, but she's having a hard time exercising those those rights. So I gave her another way, because she's still marked as manager, so I gave her another way where she could do whatever she wants. You know what I mean? So she could do whatever she wants, so she's got the power of manager. Now, again, but you know, but she can't use it as just the manager that I assigned her to. So that's weird. She was able to in the beginning, but then it stopped. But um, after that, I put on the Oculus device on her to show what the VR world is like and that's when the place started coming in people start coming in and people next door stuff next chair was started asking us about what the hell is that what is that you know and i told him it was the oculus for your device and stuff he's like what can you do it i'm like it's what can't you do i'm like you on the computer you can go on a computer you can go netflix amazon prime fucking youtube vr and you could do anything on this device, anything, you know, music, you know, anything, anything. And he's like, oh, that's awesome, that's awesome. 
you know, and I was, I wanted her to see it just down the rabbit hole, just to see what it looked like, because that gameplay was amazing. I beat it, you know what I mean? I beat it. That gameplay was amazing. But, uh, yeah, after we did that, we walked around a little bit, you know what I mean? Oh, no, no, no. After we did that, we asked the lady, uh, if it'd be alright if we could get another thing of chicken. And I got another drink, you know what I mean? And, uh, that drink tasted correct. That drink made up for the last one. It was double what I expected it, you know, as a normal. Like I said, it was double. So I guess that for another guy did that one. Or girl, girl guy, whatever. Yeah, they blew it different. Because I was like, wow. And I was like, this is what I expected. This is what I want. You know what I mean? So I was happy about that, you know? And uh, we, we, you know, we spent our time there. We, I mean, we left. You know, we didn't want to overstay our welcome because they started crowding up, you know, so they would need this, our seat soon. So we left, walked around for a little bit of bullshit, and um, went into CVS uh, or something to that extent. She got a card. I got, you know, I pulled out some money at the ATM. Um, and then we walked to the bus station. And uh, I had a medical ride that was supposed to pick me up at a certain time. They didn't come. So I was like, go oh, fuck them. It's only $10 in the cab, and the cab's right there. I was like, it's $4 from them, so it's $6 more and a few dollar tip. You know what I mean? Yeah. I'm, not, I'm not not getting picked up. You know what I mean? She's like, yeah, I'm Hezmar trained too. Like, who trains here? I was like, all right, let me say goodbye to you right away. You know, I give out all this stuff, and maybe, you know, we're definitely going to see each other often. And, uh, you know, I took the cab home, and, like, later on, they're calling me. I didn't answer. They're calling me to see if I need the ride still at the train station. Like, you stupid. You know what I mean? I had a curfew, and I want to make it home by my curfew. You know what I mean? For parole. So, um, yeah, you know, that's that, that was the day. And that blew my mind. It blew my mind that that was a girl. You know, that she was a girl. And she said, that's why I didn't give you the number. Because I had a feeling you would eventually say, let's just voice chat like humans. You know, because I always say that, like, everybody wants to only text. Let's be humans and talk. You know what I mean? Like, real humans. So let's go out somewhere. You know? Everybody wants to hibernate in their houses. Other than work, but hibernate in their houses. And talk to people only on the computers. You know? I'm not for that, you know what I mean? I didn't, I didn't get raised that way, you know? I was locked up for this time where all you people changed, you know? But, um, yeah, we, you know, she's a, she's a good friend. She's my friend. So I got a friend that'll actually hang out, leave their house, and, you know, I can go out there and see them in the city. Um, they're in Manhattan, you know? And, uh, or she can come come out again. I'll meet her in the same spot. We'll do the same thing. Go to that same same place. If I try another place out, but probably go to that place and just try a different meal. But uh, yeah. So that that was the story. That was the story of my day with my manager and how she blew my mind being a girl. You know, I was like, you you <laughs> you made me thankful that you're a girl. You know, not because of any wrong reasons, only because I started thinking that you might have been a little crooked, you got arrow, you know? She laughed, she's like, no, no, that's the whole thing. You know, I couldn't give you my number. You know, I was, that's why I was only wanted to do text. You know, because now, now we text, we have no problem texting each other. You know, because obviously I know she's a girl now, you know? But she's a good girl, she's a very good girl. Um, she's, she's a little older than me, you know, she's older than me, but couldn't tell, can't tell. Um, she's mature, she's very, 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 uh, caring, not just about me, about other people, you know, um, like what she try, what she does is, that's kind of what she does, is like help other people, like verbally, you know, and I believe she was trying to get her a bunch of credentials for it too, because I obviously get paid more with all these credentials, but, uh. You know, that's what she does, you know, and so that kind of explains why she left such great uh, comments on my videos because that was exactly what it, she meant it to do. It motivated me 
it made me feel better when I wasn't feeling so good, you know? So, so that was it. I'm not going to keep you guys like Fava, but, you know, we'll see each other again, me and her. And, uh, yeah, she's my friend. And, uh, manages a girl. Buzz Buzz is a little, little boy, you know what I mean? But, but, uh, she manages a girl. And how you doing? Hey, school, what's up? And, uh, doing this video late. It's just like 1 o'clock in the morning, so I'm going to not going to text her tell her I did a video. She'll see it tomorrow. You know, I'll text it tomorrow. But the rest of you guys, I kept you for only 15 minutes. So you probably left like 10, 12 minutes ago. All right, but subscribe. I do it for the subscribers. All right.